Okay, so let's continue now the questions of Mr. Amos. So number two, his question is, I have tried importing drawings saved in 2018 version of AutoCAD and I can't seem to import it. Oh, the answer for that, Amos, is nope again. <laughs> you cannot import the 2018 version. It is better if you can save it in 2010 first because 2010 version AutoCAD is the most reliable version in Dialux for now. You can also have it in 2015, but if you want to see the thumbnail properly in Dialux Evo, I will show you now, then please use this um, 2010 version. You can see here now I use 2000 version um, imported to this Dialux Evo. That's why you can see the thumbnail properly of this AutoCAD. If you use 2010, it will be just like a a thumbnail for AutoCAD and you cannot see those drawings. So better use the 2010 version. All right. So number three is how I can rename my rooms instead of the default one and two. All right. It's easy. All you have to do is go to your, for example, I go here and um, I will open my name labels here, showroom designation. And uh, you can see room number 20 here, for example. It's I'd, There are three ways on how to label or rename your room. One is just by clicking this one. Why oh, it's not clicking? Go to the text, letter T here, and then click the text. And then you can edit it here. You can say change. And for example, instead of room number two, I will say this is garden. Okay, and then press enter and now you have your garden now in your label okay the other way is to do it here in your assessment zone so go and click the assessment zone click it and then here you can see that the assessment zone says it is garden and if you want to check others for example this one so instead of room number six I will label this one as hallway then press enter if I want to generate calculation for this I will just check it and if I don't want then I will uncheck it okay and the third one is go to the three or the um, I call this as three section or three tab where you can see all the objects the rooms everything inside your dialogue Evo is here and see for example the hallway Click this one, double click, and then you can label it with, for example, hallway, one, two, three, and then enter. You can see it now that it's changed into hallway number three. All right, so this is the three way on how to do it. Using the three tab, using the assessment zone, or go to the text helpline and labeling tab, and then click it, and then change it, and then edit it. Okay, so the next question will be um, how to use the material and cutout tool. Okay, see you again on the next video.